Froggy plays T-ball. Author of the book is Jonathan London. Illustrator is Frank Reckowitz, and he's the person that put the pictures in the book. Froggy stepped up to bat. He wound up and swung whack. The ball sailed up, 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 and out of the park. Home run, home run, shouted Froggy. He yelled so loud. He wake himself up. He hopped out of the bed and flopped into the kitchen. Flop, flop, flop. Let's go, Dad, said Froggy. Today's my first day of T-ball. I know, said his dad. I'm the coach. Oops, said Froggy. I know that. <laughs> Then he flopped back to his room to get dressed. Flop, flop, flop. Zap, zip, zip, zoop, zim, zup, zap. Back in the kitchen, he ate his bowl of cereal and flies. Now Froggy said his dad, remember, when you hit the ball, run the bases in the right order. First run to first. First run to first. Second run to second. Third, run to third, then run home. I know, said Froggy, and together they leaped frog all the way to the baseball field singing. First, run to first, second, run to second, third, run to third, then run home. At the baseball field, the assistant T-ball coach, Max Mother, said, Okay, team, who are we? The Giants, shouted the team, the Giants. Go, Giants! Let's play ball, she yelled. Froggy, you're up first. Go, Froggy, hollered Mom. Go, Froggy, hollered Frogalina. Gaga, Frog, Froggy, hollered Polly Wigglinina. Froggy took his first swing, swish, and he missed. Then zwish, 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 and on his last swing, his bat flew out of his hands and smacked Max in the head. Bump! Good thing he was wearing a helmet. Okay, Froggy. Good try, said Max's mother. Next up. Froggy! Yelled the coach. What? Get out there and catch some flies. Okay, shouted Froggy. So he grabbed his glove and flopped out to the right field. Flop, flop, flop and shagged some high flies buzzing around. Zap, zap. Yum, said Froggy. This is fun. Froggy, yelled the coach. What? Boink. A fly ball smacked him in the nose. Wow. I probably heard him. Pick up the ball, Froggy, yelled the coach. But Froggy was holding his nose. Throw it, Froggy. Throw it, screamed the giants. But by that time, he threw it. The Dodgers had scored four runs. So at the end of the inning, Froggy's dad said, Oh, Froggy, next time somebody hits the ball, please run for it and throw it fast. Okay, coach, said Froggy. When, when it was Froggy's next run to bat, he swung the whap, and the ball dripped off the tee. And he ran for it and threw it fast to first. Out, cried the referee at the first base. Oops, said Froggy. I threw myself out. But he still had one more chance. It was the last inning. Two outs and the bases were loaded. Froggy stepped up to bat and swung the wish. And he swung again, the wish. Then on the third swing... Whack! The ball sailed up, 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 and out of the park. The crowd went crazy. Froggy skipped around the bases, singing first run to first, second run to second, third run to third, then run home. He knew all what he was supposed to be doing. And off the field, he ran toward home. Froggy! Froggy! yelled Froggolina. What? Not your, not your home, silly. Home plate. <laughs> he made a mistake. Oops, cried Froggy, looking more red in the face than green. He ran back and stomped on, stomped on home plate and shouted, Home run! Home run! 
And when he finally got home, he hollered, I hit a homer. I hit a homer. Ho bunga. Squill Palawaglina. That's great, Froggy, said Mom. I thought that game would never end. And she gave him a hot dog with fly relish. Munch, crunch, and munch. The end.